What up, peeps? It's Mama from Joe Mama here, and today we are playing Minecraft Story Mode, Episode 8, Part 4, A Journey's End. Last time we cut it right in the middle because I had recorded the whole episode. So this little intro is just to let you know what you're going to be watching. So get ready. Here it comes. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, it is my privilege, nay, my honor, to be here today kicking off another wonderful day of the game. That's right, Adrian. And not just any day, but the final day of the game. Are our competitors ready for the final challenge? The it's Walls. The walls. So, scared? Because it's okay if you are, no one will <clears throat> judge you for it. After putting up with your breath this whole walk? Please, this walls thing doesn't scare me at all. <laughs> Still got your sense of humor, huh? Cute. Mavia, for those unfamiliar with the walls, you want to walk us through how it's played? Sure thing, Hadrian. Teams start out separated in their own sections, divided by the high inner walls. Each team has a short amount of time to gather materials, build defenses, and craft in their section before the walls come yeah. down. Wait, I only see dirt and gravel in my section. Oh, I'm sorry. Is that gonna be a problem? The sections are drawn at random. Whatever, I'll make it work. I'm that awesome. Oh, can't wait. <clears throat> Once the walls are down, it's every team for themselves. But is surviving the walls the end, Mevia? No, it is not, Hadrian. Whichever team survives the free-for-all, you need to step onto the winner's platform in the center of the arena. Winner takes all! But let's not get ahead of ourselves, because that's only if the would-be winners can defeat... Uh, gladiators! <laughs> that's right! So all competitors better get to gathering materials because that clock is ticking! Too dark. Well, hopefully it's not all dirt and gravel. It is. Adrian, I can't help but notice that our newcomer Jesse's section has a disproportionate amount of dirt and gravel. Oh, funny how the universe works. Like it's all part of a plan or a deal. Nope, just dirt. Oh, Come man. on! I'm guessing that's the eponymous wall. Gravel? Gravel, that's worse than dirt! At least they gave me a crafting table. Now, if only I actually had anything to craft with. Oh, do you know what time it is? Ask me what time it is, Mavia. What time is it, Hadrian? It's time for the wall! The competitors are like wild ocelots, sizing each other up, unmoving, before they go in for the kill. <clears throat> Hang on now, we em got movement. Really? Looks like the gladiator formerly known as Emily is preparing her attack. And Jesse, the newcomer, is just painfully unarmed and unprotected. Jesse. This could get ugly. Let's hope. Okay, do whatever it is you have to do. Whatever you say. Jesse isn't even trying to defend himself.
gonna try giving that friends thing a shot. It appears Emily has opted to not strike Thank down. Thank you, the you made the right decision. And the other well, you could say you really inspired me. Oh, well, that's could, but what's don't. This isn't how it was supposed to go. What's going on? I have no idea. Come on, over here. Yeah. Why aren't you all killing each other? Yeah, see, usually all the little teams kill each other. We're not killing each other because we're done fighting, Slab. It's over. Uh-huh. So why do you still have your weapons out? Done fighting each other. Don't you see? None of us are the enemy. It's them. They're the enemies. They're behind everything. Oh, my head hurts. Too many perspectives. And it appears that Jesse has decided that deals don't need to be kept and is trying to convince the gladiators to follow suit. You are not going to bully us. Wait, wait, wait. Hadrian's the bully, not us. Woo! That's a relief. Oh, imbeciles! Lad, fire! What should we do? Uh, uh, uh. I'm sure that the slaughter will commence soon. Right? With Slab leading the charge, it should be no problem at all. You should be on our side. Join us. I don't know. Facebook finds that idea weird. Not going with them, Slab? In my life, I've done some things I'm not proud of. But I won't work for bosses who use people or manipulate them. That's inconsiderate. But you, when I was mean to you, pushed you around and made you go to the tower with me, you got that I was just doing my job and came anyway so we could be on time. That was real considerate. I will join you, Tiny Jesse. I think it's time for us to finish this together. It appears all the competitors are headed towards the victory platform. As stated in our rules, anyone who is not eliminated may step on the victory platform and win the games. It looks like they are going to do this together. Right behind you, fearless leader. Eight, two, slab. You pay for that. This wasn't the deal, Jesse. No, no! And they've done it. The competitors have all stepped onto the platform together, which, by the Builder Game Bylaws, means they are all right. Which I'm sure my colleague means to say, we are going to find some way to disqualify them. No, we are not. They all win. No! no! Mevia, Otto, with me. We're ending this. We had a deal, and you broke it. We had an agreement! You promised me! And to think we let you compete! Hadrian, I'm not stupid. I knew that you would never honor our deal. That's not the point here! This is up to you! We control the games! We decide their outcome! Mevia... Shut up, Otto! This runt needs to pay for ruining our fun! Seems like you're losing your temper there, Mevia. What's the matter? Not having fun anymore? Why, you little... Now, Mevia... Jesse won these games fair and square. He's earned the Atlas. Otto, I would think very carefully about what you're doing. I have. Jesse, with the power vested in me as an officiator of the Builder Games, I am proud of paying Otto. Hey, Otto, what are you doing? Now it's been fun, really, but I think it's about time we end this. Surrender the Redstone Heart now. Now, because uh, I will trap you here forever. You want the Redstone Heart? You're going to have to pick it out of my inventory. Fine by me. The heart weighs more fun anyway. Oh, this is useless. Well, well. Uh, Just when you thought M had your... M, come back! Now that you've lost your oversized friend, you really don't stand a chance. Run away, little Emily. I'm still with you, Jesse. Thank you. You're gonna need all the help you can get, Jesse. 
Hundreds of competitors to these respawn pits. Never knew it hurt so much. Sorry. That's probably not helping your mood right now. It's over. I... Oh, I don't think so. It's us! Yeah! I'm so happy to see you guys. I know you said you were done helping me, but I hope you can give me another chance. You know, because I'm awesome. As someone once told me, Teamwork makes the dream work. So let's get to work. Let's take them down. But I lost my inventory when I respawned. How am I supposed to get the Atlas back without any weapons or armor or anything? Well, we may have made a little stop in Hadrian's inventory room and helped ourselves to a few things. Awesome. Here, buddy. Wow. Take this. Thanks. Hey, suspenders. Over here. Tim's armor belongs to you now. Time to kick some old builder butt. It's now to pick a weapon to go with my sweet new armor. Doesn't really matter what we pick, right, Joe? As far as the weapon. Ooh, nice sweet. Now what should we do with all those other competitors who betrayed us? Well, Mevia, spending eternity in the quartz mines doesn't seem like punishment enough. <laughs> I have something special in mind for them. Hadrian! Mevia! This game just went into overtime! Well, isn't that cute? You found Tim's armor! You don't know my friends, Hadrian. Those friends of yours will just hold you back in the end, slugger. Oh, I'm gonna enjoy crushing you. Yes. No, no, it can't be! 
You never give up. Wow, her inventory was huge. Mavia, come on! What kind of rookie move was that? Stone. You mess with all of us. No, Jesse! I believe Find in you! Shut you up! You think this is going to help? You're deluded! Let's take him to the slab lab. <laughs> I, uh, I, I'm, I'm still workshopping that one. Shut up. Let's go. God! You never could have won on your own. Wish you had friends like mine yet? Shut up! Just shut up! All of you, shut up! I see you don't like having a live audience, Adrian. Jesse, remember Spleef! Got it! Say it again. his benefits plan. Oh, hang on, hang on! Jesse, you did it! Again! Feels like I say that a lot. I couldn't have done anything without all of you. Got that right. Well done, Jesse. An excellent job. Uh, thanks, Otto. You have truly shown my friends and I the error of our ways. I'm glad to put this whole messy business behind us. Start over. Man, do you need some new friends, you know that? Yes, I have come to that same conclusion, and I am working on it. You do that. I also know that the Atlas is not mine to keep. Ah! No! You have fairly defeated them. Seems only fair that you get to decide their fate. And with the Atlas, you can send them anywhere you want. Hmm. You know, there was this game that Olivia and I used to play back in our treehouse. Huh? Remember? We called it, Which Would You Rather Fight? I forget what we chose. And that's when I yanked Pama's redstone heart right out. The whole thing shut down. Man, you guys have had some crazy adventures. So many people trying to kill you. Goodbye, Jesse. Goodbye. Is that all of them? Everyone that wants to go home anyhow. Except you folks, that is. I can't believe how many competitors actually want to stay and keep playing the games. Thanks to you, my intrepid new friend, I can actually work on making them fun again. Very exciting. It'll be more challenging just by myself, but a good challenge. You promised they'll stay fun this time, right? Oh, yes. I don't intend to let the games get corrupted like they did before. And I'm going to help, too. You taught me a lot about fairness, Jesse. And I'd like to use that new knowledge for something good. Oh, and speaking of fairness, I think this is your... I got his journal bag. Oh, man. There was some good stuff in there. I was really moved. Awesome. I guess he wasn't so immovable after all. <laughs> well, Em, how about you? You said you wanted to go home, right? Yes, I just can't decide if it's what I want. 
You get to leave and go on more adventures. Do I really want to go back to farming? I mean, it has been ages since I've seen it, and I miss my friends, but what if I'm bored? Well, if you want, you can come with us. Oh, huh, really? Like, really? Yeah, we could always use another awesome person, and, well, you're pretty awesome. Ah, oh, Jesse! That's wonderful! Oh, thank you so much! Hey, Ivor. Oh, hello. What you doing? I was just observing Harper, all by herself, over there. She seems lonely. Say goodbye to Harper. Come on. Hey, Harper. Oh, hey, Jesse, Ivor. I was just watching folks head on home. Things really worked out, huh? Well, I guess this is goodbye. I'm going to head on back to Crown Mason and see how the post Palma construction is going. Just hope they'll take me back. It's not my real home, but it's the closest thing I've had for, well, a long time. We'll just go with that. Don't worry. I'm sure they'll come around. I sure hope you're right. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. Getting over the I was a bad guy hump can be awkward, but hopefully soon they'll invite you right back into their lives. Right, Jesse? You are a strange, strange man, Ivor. But you know something? You're okay. Ivor is strange. Take care of each other, all right? And I'll see you around. Bye, Harper. Bye, Harper. Yes, goodbye. Come on. You're amazing. <laughs> So, how do we get home now? Well, the Atlas belongs to Jesse now. The deal's a deal and all that. Let's go home. Sweet. Uh, how does it work? Now you just say where you want to go, and the Atlas will show you the way. Why don't you just go ahead and open it? Okay, Book. Take us home. told you that she's coming with? Yeah, she's already promised to show me that awesome spin move. It's not so great. Figure it's about time we get heading on home, huh? That sounds awesome. Yeah! Home, here we come. portals. We're home. Yeah, and I couldn't have done it without you guys. You're the best team anyone could ever ask for. Oh, that's lovely. Ah, oh, you big sap. I'm just so glad we're all back together. That atlas is so cool. I'm glad Otto let you keep it. Fabulous. Yes. And that's not all we got. Seriously? What else did you get? Yeah, show him, Jesse. the ever source, the magical source of all of Sky City's precious materials. Whoa, wicked! <gasps> the mask of Cassie Rose, AKA the White Pumpkin. Oh man, that's even creepier looking than I imagined. Oh. 
Palma's redstone heart. I know that Palma was evil and everything, but I still kind of wish I could have seen it. Portal Atlas. I could have lost all the rest so long as we got to keep that. Ha! Huh. I wonder what Soren would have thought of it. So much power contained within such a tiny Whoa. object. Easy there, Ivor. <clears throat> Sorry. The Enchanted Flint and Steel. The one that started the whole thing. Yeah, none of these other adventures could have happened if it weren't for this. I can't believe you got to do all those incredible things. Makes sense, though. You were gone a long time. Wait till we show you all the improvements we've been making to town. Um, Jesse? What's up, Lucas? So, I've been writing stuff in here, you know? And, well, it's kind of become like a legitimate book. But there's just one problem. I still need to put what happened to you. You've, well, you've been the hero of this whole story. It wouldn't be right to end it without saying what happened to the hero. Just say, and he couldn't have done it without his friends. Got that right. You know something? I really like that. There. Done. Well, tell the next one, anyway. I was thinking that maybe we could put it in here with the other treasures? I know it's not as cool as, like, a portal atlas. That's a great idea, Lucas. It's perfect. <gasps> Hang on. What is it? Wasn't that where the portal atlas was a minute ago? Yeah, that was definitely where you put it. Guys, flint and steel are missing too. And where's Ivor? Ivor. <laughs> Adventure! Adventure! He must be headed for the portal network. Is that bad? What should we do? That's all right. He went on just as epic a journey as the rest of us. If he wants to dive right back into the portal network, well, I think he's earned it by this point. So you think we should just let him go? Yeah, I do. Come on, guys, let's go home. What an
next to it's the notification bell. Hit that. Hit that little bell. Notifications for all. when we upload a new video. And if you are a new school if you subscriber, go subscribe. No, let us know in the comments so we can give you a shout out in a future video. And go subscribe to Fox Gaming. Thanks, guys. Bye. Wait, don't leave the, the video yet. You gotta show them what happens at the end of the credits. I didn't think there was anything at the end of the credits. Oh.